What's up, YouTube? Jeff, your style OG. And on today's video, we've got a Ratchet Belt Roundup. If you're new to the channel, we release a new video every day at 4 p.m. Eastern discussing various men's lifestyle topics such as style, grooming, and dating. I invite you to subscribe and tap the notification bell and join us. And to my returning friends like Dean Noble, salute. Now, if you've been a part of the Style OG family for a little while, you know we got a little inside joke around here. Jeff hardly ever wears belts. And that's true, I don't wear them very often. But when I do, I only wear one type of belt. That's the ratchet belt. It's a more durable type of belt, more precise fit, will last you longer. It's one of my favorite developments in style over the last 10 years. And there are several ratchet company brands in this game. That's what we're gonna talk about today, how ratchet belt works, and I'm gonna do a rundown, comparison and contrast between four different brands. Now this video is sponsored by one of the brands we're gonna talk about, Core Essentials, who not only sponsored today's video, but provide the Stylogy family with a 10% discount. Just use the code Stylogy at checkout for 10% off your order. Just make sure you go to coreessentials.com to place that order, use the code, and help support the Stylogy channel. Although they did sponsor the video, I still get to give the pros and cons of every belt here, including core, mission, slide belts, and answer. I'm gonna give you the distinguishing characteristics of each of the company's belts. And even before we get to the comparison, I'm going to give you a quick Cliff Notes version on how ratchet belts work and why they're better than your traditional belt with hold. So without further ado, let's get into this ratchet belt rundown. First off, let me give you the Cliff Notes version on how ratchet belts work. Now first, the reason why they're better than a belt with holes is if you ever use a regular belt, you know how the holes are never correctly spaced? They're either a little too wide apart or too close, hard to get that perfect fit. A ratchet belt is much more precise, and here's why and how it works. What you're gonna receive is a leather strap or belt part of the belt. What you have to do is cut off the precise amount of length of belt you need to fit you. Now, all of these companies provide a guide on precisely how to cut it, but let me give you the easy way to do it. The easiest way to do it, strap the belt through the belt loops, and what you wanna have is when you get to that first loop on the left side as you're going through, you wanna have about three or four inches of belt left. That's a good guideline on how much to cut. Now, I always suggest cut a little less, you can always go back. So maybe leave four or five inches. If you have to go back and cut more, no problem. And you make sure you cut the raw end, which is from the opposite end of where the tracks are. Then all you have to do is attach the raw end through your buckle. Do now slide it through the buckle. You hear that clicking of the ratchet, you can get exact precise fit. The belt slides along these little tracks that are spaced very little increments in between, giving you a precise fit. Very different from a belt with holes where the holes are spaced in between. You gotta, gotta get lucky. Ratchet belt, much more precise. Take it off, you just hit the release, slide it out. Very easy to take off, very convenient. That's basically how you use a ratchet belt. If you want a more complete rundown on how and why you should use these ratchet belts, I'll leave a link in the description to a video I did a while back titled How and Why You Should Use a Ratchet Belt. Now let's get into the rundown of the various ratchet belt brands I've had experience with, starting with the first brand I ever tried out, Anson Belts. Now Anson Belts retail for 49 bucks. And there's several categories you wanna pay attention to when deciding what to get in a ratchet belt. One of them being price. The second thing you need to pay attention to, what kind of leather do you get? Anson Belts, you get full grain leather. Anson Belts are available in two different widths. One and a quarter inch widths, which they suggest for a more formal dress belt, and one and a half inches for a more casual belt. Comes to the width of the track, which is important, the longer the width, the more positions you can use, the shorter, the less position. With Anson belts, you have a seven and a half inch track. It gives you 32 different positions you can position your ratchet belt in. Another thing you wanna pay attention to with your ratchet belts, what kind and how many varieties can you get in your buckle? The buckle is gonna be pretty prominent. You wanna make sure you get the right kind of buckle for you. The Anson buckles are made of alloy. They have four different styles of buckles with various finishes. They have a classic, a traditional, a golf, and an onyx. Now, as far as the length of the belt, 
Anson offers a one size fits all belt and it goes all the way up to guys with 50 inch waist. As far as my bigger guys that might have a waist past 50 inches, Anson belt's probably not gonna work for you. Now, Anson belts offers your classic traditional belt colors and a wide range of other colors such as red, blue, and yellow. Anson also sells belts for women and children. I do really like about the Anson belt, I like how the buckle kind of has an open face making the belt look a little bit more like a traditional belt. It's a definite positive if you're gonna buy an Anson belt. As far as standing behind the belts, Anson gives you a 30 day guarantee and a one year warranty with a lifetime warranty on the buckle mechanism. The very first ratchet belt I had experience with, very good belts, an Anson belt. Next up, we have Core Essentials, my personal favorite and the one I recommend most of the time when guys ask. Not only because they sponsored the video, but they have a few distinguishing characteristics that I think really sets them apart from the competition. Let's get into it. Now, first off, Core Essentials belts retail for 49 bucks. What do you get for your 49 bucks? You get a full grain leather belt. If you buy the one size fits all, goes up to 44 inches. But for my bigger guys, they have an extra large size that goes all the way up to 54 inches. Now, first up, the thing that I think sets Core Essentials belts apart more than any other characteristic is the track width. Because their track is 10 inches, it allows for more adjustable points. The Core Essential belt has 42 adjustable points where the other belts usually have around 30, giving you the ability to make many more micro adjustments on this belt. Now this belt comes in a nice one and three eighth inches width, which I think is a great middle ground between casual and formal belts. Now the second thing that really makes Core's belt stand out are the buckle mechanisms themselves. First of all, you get a wide range of choices in buckles, which is great when you're trying to have variety. They have 14 different buckle designs with various finishes. Give me the most choices of any ratchet belt on the market. And on top of that, they designed their mechanism themselves in California, in-house, and it's a patented design. And one of the great things about it, it has a spring-loaded release. This is gonna make more durable release, lasting longer, and smoother release when you're taking the belt off. And to me, when I compare a lot of the belts, the buckle really stands out. It feels sturdier. I feel more confident in it. And I know it's gonna last longer than your typical buckle. Another great thing about the Core Essentials buckle is made of stainless steel and alloy. That solid stainless steel, very durable, gonna last a long time. Another thing I like about Core Essentials, which this can be looked as a pro or a con, but to me, it's a pro. They only make men's belts. I like companies that concentrate on us. And Core only makes your classic belt colors, your blacks, your browns, things along those lines. Looking for a wider range of colors, you're gonna have to go to the other companies for those as well. Core concentrates on your classic colors. Core also stands behind their belts, your 30 day money back guarantee, and a one year warranty on all their products. Like I said, if you want a belt that's much more precise because of the wider track, definitely go with Core Essentials. And they also have the widest range of choices in buckle varieties, and to me, the best buckle out of the ratchet company. Next up on our ratchet belt roundup, we have Mission Belts. One of the great thing about Mission Belts, they have the lowest starting price point at $34.95. So if you're a little hesitant to get into ratchet belts, less of a commitment. Now your $35 Mission Belt isn't gonna be full grain leather, it's gonna be a genuine leather, which is a little bit of a lower quality leather than full grain, but you get to save that money of paying only 35 bucks. The genuine leather strap with a synthetic coating. For that $35 price, you get a one size fit all belt that goes up to 42 inches. If you need a belt bigger than that, that's gonna be an extra large belt that goes way up to 56 inches, but you have to pay five extra bucks for the extra large belt. Now they do make the buckle choices pretty simplistic for you. They only have one buckle design with various finishes. It's a very uniform design that I think looks good on almost everybody, but it does narrow your choices a bit as compared to the other companies. The buckle has various finishes, and from what I've seen, it's made of alloy and acrylic. Now, another good thing about Mission, if you wanna get a higher quality belt, they offer different price points or different types of leather. They also have full grain leather, which starts at 55 bucks and goes up to 75 bucks. So if you want a little bit of a higher quality leather, you can spend a little bit more and get one with Mission. Mission also has your standard seven and a half inch wide track line that allows for 32 different positions of your ratchet belt. So just like Anson, they make belts for men, women, and children. So if you're gonna get gifts for the women and children in your life, 
Mission is a good choice as well. Mission also offers a wide range of leather colors, your traditional colors, and your red, blue, and yellows among the web belts as well. Mission belt, like I said, a lot of times I recommend these for guys that don't mind a little bit of a lower quality leather belt, but wanna pay a lower price point, don't wanna make that huge commitment. A good quality belt with different price points, different quality of leathers, good choice if you grab the Mission belt. And last, but certainly not least, on our Ratchet Belt Roundup, we have the company that's been in the game longer than all the others, Slide Belts, who have been around since 2008. Now with Slide Belts, you get a wide range of quality of leathers at different price points. They have an entry level price, a faux leather or vegan belt that starts at 38 bucks. You can get a top grain leather belt from around 60 to 62 bucks, or you can get what I have here, a full grain high quality leather belt from 85 to around 95 bucks. As you can see, Slide Belts has a wide range of choices when it comes to leather, but it's the most expensive out of the bunch that we're looking at. However, I must say, although it is the most expensive belt, to me, this is the best leather of all the belts that I've tried of any of the companies. It's just a nice, high quality, full grain leather. You're playing a premium, but you're getting a nice premium leather for your money. Now, as far as belt lengths, with Slide Belts, you can get your standard one size fits all, that gets you up to 48 inches, or you can get the custom or extra large belt that goes up to 55 inches. Now Sly has one buckle style with various finishes. Although it's only one design, I think it's a design that fits a lot of guys. I think it's a versatile belt, so although you only have one choice, I think this choice is gonna work well for a lot of guys. Sly Belts is another company that does make belts for men, women, and children, if that's important to you. Now just like the other companies besides Core, this has your seven and a half inch width track line with the 32 positions that you can adjust your belt to. One of the things that I think stands out about the slide belts that I really like, to me it's one of the easiest to remove. You just release it here and it comes out. To me, the easiest one to get on and off. So it's definitely a point for slide belts. As I mentioned earlier, slide belts are gonna give you a wide range of choices of belts from your faux leather all the way down to 38 to your full grain leather up to 95 the most expensive of the bunch, but a wide range of choice. And out of all the belts I've tested, my favorite leather, but the most expensive at 80 to 95 bucks. And one other standout point about slide belts, they have the longest money back guarantee, 45 days, and have the standard one year warranty like all the other companies. The company has been in business the longest, and another belt that I definitely can recommend if you're in the market for a ratchet belt. Okay, so there you have it. My ratchet belt roundup, and comparison of Core, Mission, Anson, and Slide Belt. Once again, I wanna thank Core Essentials for sponsoring this video. Make sure you head over to coreessentials.com, use your discount code STYLOG, help support Core, and in turn, help support the STYLOG channel. As always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, hit that like button. Helps the channel to grow. And of course, tap the notification bell so you don't miss any of the videos released every day at 4 p.m. Eastern and I'll check you out tomorrow.